Hello, this is Geotechland, and today I'll be talking about what I think is the best Linux OS for your laptop. And as you guys can see from this name here, Solus OS, I think, is the best OS for a laptop. Now, I'm not talking about a gaming laptop. I'm talking about a pretty mid-range to even... Uh, low budget laptop here now the specs on this is I got an i5 7th generation mobile CPU from Intel and and I'm really only stuck with the um, Intel HD 620 graphics so again not much in terms of power there but I don't really need that power for this laptop this is mainly a laptop you use to browse the web maybe um, take notes or even use LibreOffice to write essays for college um, now of course I'm not in college so I probably wouldn't be using this here now this other one is maybe more specific to me but for example Trellby I write screenplay so by default Trellby is uh, in Solus's repositories or in their I guess in their software center so that's one of the reasons why I like Solus for a laptop because all the uh, programs I'm going to be using are available in its repositories so you have Trellby for writing screenplays um, that I can take on the go or again web browsing uh, with Firefox here now another key thing is that this PlayStation 1 emulator I can play it on this as well and again, for a laptop with this power, this is really, uh, it's almost like a perfect match for this. Whereas even though I have Dolphin installed, which I can find somewhere here. Yeah, strangely enough, I'm not seeing Dolphin. And maybe I deleted it by accident. But let's check. So apparently I deleted Dolphin by accident. So let's get that installed while we're here. Why not, right? Get you guys an idea of what the install process is like. But yeah, I generally don't have Dolphin installed here because, or I generally am not really gonna be using Dolphin because to be honest, I think GameCube and PS2 games, even though the emulators are available here with Solus by default, I feel like those are still more perfect for a an actual desktop so you can play them in 4k and you just need a little bit more power than, um, than that to really run them as good as i prefer but dolphin uh, or gamecube and wii games technically are somewhat playable with these specs but i personally wouldn't and i don't think it's meant for a, a laptop of this power but again something like a playstation emulator is perfect and and it's available in the repositories of um, Solus. So yeah, just by default, it has all the programs I need, a browser, a text editor, a document writer, a perfect um, emulator that uh, pretty much is in tune with the specs on your device here. And of course I can record via OBS. And of course with Steam, I can download Steam and again it's in its repositories by default. You generally don't have any issues installing that. Whereas something like Ubuntu based like Pop OS or Ubuntu 18.04, yeah, it's kind of messy to install. I mean you can go to the software center, but um, I know I sometimes get weird issues trying to install that and even though I could install them, it just takes away from the experience there a little bit. So this laptop again, I'm not going to be playing anything fancy here, but I've got these two games right now, uh, The Binding of Isaac this is usually what I first installed on a laptop when I install a brand new OS because it's kind of good to test it out. And so I have that, Swords of Ditto, it's still not really playable on Linux because of the sound issues, but again, those two games are perfect for this laptop with these specs. and. So just to summarize, everything I need for this laptop is included in the software repositories of Solus. 
and it makes it really easy to uh, get going here. So Solus is the perfect Linux OS for your laptop. I know I recently released a video where I switched to Solus to Manjaro on my desktop at least. And I have my reasons for that. I think it's better for me at the moment for desktop than Solus, but I always said Solus is still probably like my number two OS. So I went ahead and got set up with this here on my laptop. Other than that, guys, I think you guys should give it a shot. I'll put their website in the description below. This is going to be the perfect Linux OS for you guys. So thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time.